Robinson and I am about to read one of the winning entries of GWR's short story competition. So are you sitting comfortably for a Trakanori story? Then I'll begin. Crow's ready. This one is by Karis Groves, who's seven years old and it's all about smuggled goods. It was as the Great Western train was pulling out of the station that it first caught my eye. I couldn't believe what I was seeing. Pink smoke appeared. My parents came out of the train in a mysterious way. Their hair and eyes were different. I quickly hid behind Grandma. I said to Grandma, is that actually them? She said, yes. So I went a little bit closer to them. They said, hello. I said, hello, back in a frightened voice. I asked my parents to follow me. I led them to the woods next to the train station. In the woods was a cave I play hide and seek in. Near the cave was a little cottage. It was getting dark, so we went to the cottage and had supper. I went to bed and read a story by Enid Blyton. When the light went off in my parents' bedroom, I tiptoed downstairs and put my coat on. I quietly opened the door of the cottage. I ran to the cave. In the cave was a secret passageway to the train station. In the passageway, I heard my parents talking about smuggled goods. Then I knew they weren't my real parents. I quickly ran back to the station. I saw my real mum and dad on the train talking to grandma and grandpa. I told them the whole story. They called the police. The police discovered the stolen goods on the train and caught the thieves. What a story, Karis.